Good morning, good morning. Right, um, oh, are you bored with that yet? Get it? Bored? Bored? Hmm. Okay, the idea is that I'm going to be putting down some track and laying out a model railway. And the thinking behind this particular railway is let's transport ourselves back to, oh, I don't know, 1955? Uh, some of you were born then, some of you weren't. <laughs> I wasn't. And let's imagine it's, oh, I don't know, November. And let's imagine that Dad wants to surprise little Jimmy on Christmas morning with a train set. Now, there's a few little problems in 1955 with surprising little Jimmy with a train set, not least of which is money. Money was tight then. Uh, it still is tight now in my household. So Dad, who possibly worked in a factory where they had machines delivered in big crates, he's, he's got himself a big sheet of plywood and he's got some battens and he's made up a board and he's been doing this in his shed when little Jimmy's asleep because you don't want to spoil the surprise and he wanted to paint it and kicking around at work there were some old tins of bits of paint so he's, he's slapped a coat of paint on it and now he's going to start putting track down so that's the story so far. Right, I'm going to drink a cup of tea. You probably knew that. And then I'm going to start track laying. Well, tea is over. Let's get started. Ah, uh, yeah, this is going to be fun. Well, if it looks a little bit confused, <laughs> That's because it is. Um, it's a very simple idea. It's going to have one loop with no switches, no points, no crossovers, nothing in. So that trains can just hurtle round and round and round. The inner loop is going to have this sort of strange arrangement which will lead to an engine shed down there, uh, a little head shunt and a coaling siding. Trust me, it does make sense, I think. <laughs> 